And now, your forecast from the Fox 55 Severe Weather Center. Well, some good news for tomorrow. If you're not in quarantine or you're sheltering in place in your house, it's going to be great weather to be outside. We just got to get rid of these few snow flurries that are moving through our area right now. Just basically along and south of US 30, some light to moderate snow right now, but not too much cause for concern. Accumulations will mostly be less than an inch throughout the entire region. Now, this has rain chances, but precipitation chances in general low. Basically 0% and then bumping up to 10% by the time 7 a.m. rolls around, but really that's on the very low side. We're not going to see precipitation basically after the midnight hour and into the morning. So your morning commute, if you're heading off to early morning worship services or a breakfast or what have you, they're going to be nice and dry. Maybe one or two wet spots on elevated surfaces. Current conditions right now, temperatures are sitting in the low 30s. Most of us around the freezing mark right now. Waking up in the morning going to be a little bit lower than the freezing mark. 8 a.m. temperatures will be around 29. 36 at the noon hour, temperatures bumping up into the mid 40s by the time 5 p.m. rolls around. And we're going to see plenty of sunshine in the afternoon, mixed with a few clouds, but no real cause for concern. We're going to stay dry. Now, temperatures over the next four days, they're going to be on the rise. Just a little bit below where we're supposed to be for your Sunday, 45 for that high. 49 on Monday, temperatures bumping up to 51 on St. Patrick's Day. Now there is a small rain chance in there, and then that's what's going to call those, cause those temperatures to drop down into the mid 40s for Wednesday. Now you notice precipitation chance for the next five days. Tuesday, there is a chance. Thursday and Friday, it's probable that we're going to see some precipitation and possibly a few thunderstorms. The reason being is that our weather pattern quite strong. You see that system basically out in the Texas Oklahoma panhandle. It's going to move right towards us Thursday into Friday. As it does, we're going to see southerly flow push into our region and a warm front set up basically right on top of us. And as it does, we're starting to see some strong air lift up into the atmosphere, causing a few isolated thunderstorms. Now, in terms of anything being severe, it's way too far out to know whether that's going to be the case just yet, but we're keeping an eye on things. Temperatures on Thursday bumping up to 60, 62 on Friday, but I think this is going to be an early morning high temperature and temperatures are going to slide through the day, settling at 27 on Saturday morning and then temperatures in the low 40s for your Saturday afternoon. That's all for your forecast this evening. If you want more weather information after the show, go to our website, WFFT.com.